Okay, Claude Pallon here, Affiliate Starting Line. Welcome. It's going to be a, a short video on how to create an album in Google Photos. So how do you create an album? Well, first you've got to come into Photos. You make sure you're into Google Photos. You find it, if you recall, coming down to your apps and clicking Photos. So this is in Photos. I'm going to come up here, the nav bar, and hit the Create button. And you see here, I can create an album. So I'm going to create an album. Now I'm going to select the pictures I want in that album. So I'll take this one. Um, I'll take this one. So we have a heron, a yellow heron. We have a swamp hen. We have a green heron here. Uh, I'll take the owl and I'll take an egret. So I've got what I wanted. Uh, let me see. I'll take this grackle. And I'll create. So now I've created uh, an, an album. I'm going to name it. So I've given it a title. It's, you can see here it's dated. I've got a date range. I've got the title. Uh, if I wanted to add photos, I could click this and add photos. If I wanted to add text, I could do that. Uh, you know, I could say egret, owl, you know, whatever you wanted to put that's descriptive, grackle. Let's just give you an idea. So I have text. I could add the location where uh, this is from, this is Boynton Beach, Florida. So there you go. And then down here, I can reorder the pictures based on their uh, date of in creation. Once I'm happy, I come over here to the left and I click the check button that says done. And now I have my album. Now I still have more things I could do with it. Over here, I could still add photos. Here we have the share function. So I can share it with people. I can get the link for it, which is what I often do. This comes in handy because let's say I was doing this with family pictures. I could organize the family pictures into an album and then send the link to, to relatives. And that makes it a, very easy to, to send things around. Um, sharing. Down here, I can create a slideshow if I wanted. I can download these photos. It'll download it as a zip file. I'll show you. I could download it there. Put it, uh, send a green K birds. And I hit, and there it is on my desktop as a zip file. All I have to do is double click it, and uh, it will create the folder. So, and what else can I do? Uh, I can edit the album. So if I click edit, I can reorder the pictures. I can put this one first, this one, and so on. Uh, and then go back here and say yes. I can set the album cover. That simply says that uh, it, it will pick a, I can pick a photo that will be the symbol of that album. So let's say I pick that one, done. And then sharing options i can i can decide to, to how i was i am going to i can have anyone uh, with the link see the photos the people who've been invited or joined like here is the link itself i can collaborate with others i can have let people comment it's got a lot of interesting features here that you can play with. i can hide from albums i can delete it if i'm tired of it i don't need it anymore so this gives you an idea of what you can do with an album the most uh, useful feature i find is sharing I get the link and I send it to people that I, I want to share it with. It makes it a lot easier. I used to use Dropbox a lot and all that, but a lot of people uh, find this easier to use. So that's how you create an album in Google Photos. I hope this video has been helpful. Stay with it. Stay well. Talk soon.